Welcome to an experiment I'm calling the Narrative of Diverging Story Options. Not so for short. At the end of each segment, you'll be presented with a choice, right or left. You will need to be online to be able to follow these links. Metal Face. The Quest for the Sword of Purification. Lord Metalface Lightfoot Greenhorn is a mighty warrior, clad in armor. He works for the Knights of Order, who battle evil forces in the lands of Clard. The Knights of Order often receive noble quests from the Goddess of Purity, the Dawnstar Dragon, Asule. Her oracle relays her will to the band of brave knights. Metalface is called such because he never takes off his helm. The only visage presented is his armor. How he eats, no one knows. The title Lord was awarded to him when the king gave Metalface the deed to the land of a small country town called West Barkins. The wilderness surrounding West Barkins is mostly beautiful woods, and beyond are tall mountains that act as a natural defensive wall. All monsters in that valley were vanquished by Metalface, and the people are able to manage the defense of the roads without that threat. One day Metalface receives a quest for his eyes only. Asule wants Metalface to wield her artifact, the Sword of Purification. This legendary blade functions as a normal sword, but it has the added ability to project beams of purifying light to cure corruption spread by Maleficent's forces across Clard. Undead beings can be laid to rest by this light as well. The only clue in the note from the Oracle says that the Sword of Purification lies within the Broken Giant. Metalface's head spins with possibilities. Could it be a fallen ancient tree? Perhaps a crumbling mountain? For certain, there is always the possibility of gaining advice from a knowledgeable scribe. The choice now lies before you. Venture into the wilderness and hope to see a landmark, or consult the scribe.